I'm pretty sure that we all know who Mickey Mouse is. And if you went to a store, it would be no surprise that you would look and see there's a bunch of merchandise of him. With plush toys and all that. Heck, you might even have some yourself. And they were always cute and adorable. However, let's go back to the 1930s. Back when Mickey Mouse was beginning to be popular and he was just in movie theaters. So back then, Mickey Mouse was super popular. And of course, he had his own merchandise. And well, while some look cute like this or this right here, some also looked not so pleasant and downright creepy. So I'm here to talk about my own opinion and thoughts on these old Mickey Mouse's merchandise from the 1930s. And keep in mind, some of these might be a little disturbing. Now, I know that this was probably a different time and these look a little more better back then than it is today, but my gosh, look at this. Look at Mickey Mouse's face in this. Also, I know this is off topic, but I don't remember Mickey Mouse having whiskers. Just saying. Now, it is true that if you look at some of the pictures, like in this one with Walt Disney himself, some of these Mickey Mouse dolls look kind of cute. And then there's these. And yes, these were sold in public. Like, these were something that you can get at a store back then. But I don't know any little kids who will want to play with these with a Mickey Mouse that looks like he wants to eat you. Like, some of these toys back then looked like they had weird-looking teeth and weird-looking eyes. Like this one. Like, that does not look like Mickey Mouse. These dolls look like something out of a horror movie or something. Like this one. Like, what were these people thinking when they designed these things? Like, were they trying to freak the kids out or something? Like, just why? Why would you allow something like this to exist? Why does this exist? Like, I don't know why kids will even want to play with these back then. I mean, with the weird face, the weird teeth. Just, why? But it's also not just this that was also creepy. Back then, a lot of Mickey Mouse's stuff were, like, kind of creepy in real life. Like, even the costumes. Yes, there was, like, there was, like, some homemade Mickey Mouse costumes and stuff. And, and they look terrifying. I mean, just look at it. This does not look like Mickey Mouse. Like, why back then, everybody always made the most creepiest stuff in merchandising? Like this picture. What is wrong with Mickey's mouth in this? Or this! He looks like a giant mutant mouth monster! How would anyone find this entertaining? I swear, seeing all these pictures of these creepy dolls and these creepy costumes makes this less creepier. So, all in all, I don't know why people used to make Mickey Mouse look like this. Like, these all look like something right out of a horror movie. It does not look like Mickey Mouse at all. So, that's all I gotta say. I'm sorry if I probably disturb you all with these pictures. But I just wanted to share my opinions on this because these were creepy back then. I mean super creepy and I'm, I'm very glad that these aren't around much anymore.